What is good YouTube? Back at y'all with another video bringing y'all a sneaker uh, weekly rotation. I haven't done one in a little while but I know y'all love it so I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all. I really didn't do much to uh, this week. Pretty much just went to work, hung out, hanged out with my friends. I really didn't do too much but I thought I had a very good strong um, weekly sneaker rotation last week. If you don't follow me on Instagram, my Instagram will be down below as always. Give me a follow and you can keep up with what I'm wearing. Uh, just keep up with anything, new videos and all of that. Uh, like I said, it'll be down below in the description. But let's go ahead and get into what I wore this week. Um, the first thing being the Gel Light 3s. I wore them on Monday, just a casual Monday. Um, I actually got these for South by Southwest. It was, uh, they were sponsored by ASICS. Um, so I went ahead and got these for free from ASICS. So shout out to ASICS. Uh, for sponsoring Austin for South by Southwest. So I got these um, really dope shoe. Um, Tuesday, I went with a classic Bordeaux 07. They look really clean on camera, but in person, they're actually really beat. I wear these a lot. The toe box is super scuffed up. I really want to get another pair, but 7s, I don't really like them too much. I really don't like this thing because after you wear them so much, they just start to open up. I um, really don't really like two sevens, but this one and hair 7s are definitely um, one of my favorite 7s. Um, Wednesday, I went with the underrated 25th anniversary Atmos uh, collab. I actually saw them on some websites for discounted prices, uh, but this is a 25th anniversary pack. Uh, really just slept on just because it was all white shoe. Nobody really wants an all white shoe, and I believe the price is a little bit marked up because of uh, the premium quality you're getting out of the shoe. Uh, so yeah, it's just premium quality. Nobody really wanted to pay that marked up price says Atmos in the back and um, has hints of 3M on the back and on the front, but definitely a dope shoe for Wednesday. Uh, getting into Thursday, I went with the Ubik uh, collab. Uh, I got this in the Ubik mystery box maybe a little bit before Christmas, so maybe about six, seven months ago, I got this in the mystery box unboxing. I know some of y'all might have done it, and uh, it was either you get any of the collabs or you get clothes and stuff. Some people got really trash clothes, some people got really good. Um, unboxings like the shoes or some people got like their really crappy um, uh, anniversary or their uh, collabs and I got fortunate enough to get my size and get a really good pair of shoes from them so I got these for 60 bucks went ahead and went with that on Thursday Friday I went with um, the classic Air Max 90 in the OG infrared colorway these are a women's pair um, I slept on them when they first came out and then I saw them I was like damn I really should have gotten them. Got them, they restocked on Nike and women's and the women's sizing went up to a size 11. So I went with the size 10 which is equal to a size 8.5 in men's. Uh, really glad that I got my pair. Um, so yeah, so if y'all happen to see a women's pair, it's exactly the same as the men's pair. Um, so go ahead and grab those. Saturday was my friend's uh, 20th birthday so I went out with him, um, just threw some all white uh, Ultra Boost, sorry, <laughs> Black Felinity. This is the one with the black bottoms, not the white bottoms. I don't really like the new ones with the all white bottoms. I do like the, the classic black bottoms with the whole white caged upper. But these are super beat already. They're like, I don't know if you can really tell, but they're super, super beat. I really want to clean them up or just go buy me a new pair. But um, I know the black bottom ones are going up a lot now since they, have, they haven't really came out with those anymore. They're just coming out with the all white, triple white ones. Uh, but yeah, Saturday went with this for my friend's 20th birthday. And then uh, Sunday, last but not least, went with the OG Aquas. I really don't like 8s too much, guys. Uh, honestly, this is one of the shoes I kind of regret buying for full price. Um, retail was on 190 plus tax over here in Texas, so it came out to like $205. And now you can find them at the outlets for easy 140 And I know people who got discount codes to get them for even less than that. I kind of regret grabbing them. It is a classic colorway. I would have definitely grabbed them from the outlet, but I kind of just jumped on jumped on the shoe just because I never had a pair of Aquas before. I kind of just jumped on it, um, but really wish I would have waited. But you never know with those kind of things. There was just so many of them, and now so many of them at the outlets. You can probably still get them at the outlets to this day. Uh, but yeah, that was my uh, weekly sneaker rotation. Nothing too crazy. A couple of good shoes here and there. But let me know what you guys think about my sneaker rotation. Thank you for all the new subs, guys. My channel's been growing like always. Like I said, follow me on Instagram. I'm out. Peace.